Hi you guys, look who I have. I have all four of the Series 3 Bratz for us to unbox and guest starring Dana and Jade for second outfit try-ons because I didn't want to get a whole extra four dolls. I just figured two would be good enough since there's at least four extra outfits. We could just go ahead and use them for each other's outfits so let's go ahead and get right into it and i think we'll start with the dana one so that our other dana could get this outfit on so let me go ahead and open her box okay here she is out of the box look at how shiny her lips and her eyeshadow are all that glitter she is so cute and then here this is her poster it came like behind her in cardboard insert between this and you guys i am definitely keeping these parts of the boxes i'm gonna like cut out like all the little things that i want to keep and because i found something super cool at target in the like five dollar area you know so I found these in Target, and there's eight books with 16 pages each. They're a pretty decent size of little books, and there's like a whole bunch of different colors. Pink, red, yellow, green, blue, orange, purple. And then I got this. This is some double-sided tape, so that way I can just double-sided tape like everything into these books and i'm gonna do this with like other lines too probably like the monster high and maybe a few other things but yeah i just thought i would share that with y'all real quick in case you wanted to go check that out also like i'll be keeping this this is so pretty look at her box you guys i love this it's like a really pretty bluish purple holographic metallic -y. like it's just so gorgeous and y'all i have series two also but i just never opened their boxes but i decided to with series three and i also have series one i'm gonna leave them in box i might open the series two boxes but i'm not sure yet so i just decided well, Series 3 just came out. I might as well do it while they're freshly out. So here's her shoe, her second outfit shoe. This is really pretty. It's like a brownish, like, plummy, I don't even know how to, bronze type color. It's really nice. And then the black heel, and of course her foot. And I love the little black um, studs. I don't know what they're called but I never had this Dana I don't believe I know I think this is funk out right or I don't know I don't know but I know I had some other ones that were funk out I think this one is here's her skirt super pretty little pink skirt i love it so i'm just gonna cut everything else out real quick one thing about brats you guys they're really stuck in there like pulling her from the plastic pieces it was so hard at the her hair part and then there were so many you have to cut but i finally got her out so here's her other shoes and they're also kind of mm, Kind of have the same bronze a little bit, but different. It's a little different. It's cool though. It's more like metal-y, but also has brown in it. It's a really unique color. Anyways, let's see what the shirt underneath looks like since she has this like jacket. I haven't really seen it and it's just a pretty like golden top 
It's cute. It matches everything. And then her earrings. Her hair is a really cool style, like this braid around the, the ponytail. And you can kind of see like how they did it right there. They have the little pony piece in the back. And then it has a little bit of like um, product in it. A little bit crunchy. And just needs a little wash in the back here or a comb out to kind of help it. And then her little these are stuck to her arm. Like how they do for a lot of the OMG dolls. And they are super stiff. Like, that is crazy stiff, y'all. <laughs> oh my gosh. But I guess it doesn't really need the rubber bands anymore. And y'all, these rubber bands are good to keep in case you restyle your doll's hair. I've heard they last longer than like the kind that you can just buy in the stores. So... Then she has like some gems here, like on her little belt, kind of. It's not like a full around belt, it's like a fake belt in the front, which I like that better than real doll belts, because real doll belts are just so annoying, y'all. <laughs> but I love the little pink fluffy, I love her eyeshadow, all the pink, it's so pretty. But yeah, let's go ahead and get the other Dana in her other outfit because she doesn't look bad right now but she could look cuter but since it is a pink it might not look that great I don't know Ooh, something fell And that Jade, <laughs> she just needs a new outfit. I'm like, okay, so all the little um, plastic pieces are falling out. But she will look cute with this black top at least. And then the shoes. The skin tone is like a little bit off. It's like more pink, I think, than like this one. I don't know. We might put her back in the other shoes. Oh my gosh, if I can get it, her freaking foot in there. Yeah, I don't really like that. But I'll leave it for now. So let's go ahead and open Felicia next. Here is Felicia. Everyone's like, holy grail. <laughs> I mean, I can't believe I have her though. Like, it's so cool they made a reproduction of her at least. I have the holiday one and the Moa Loa. Mo I can't. Moa Loa. Moa Loa. I don't know. I have those two, but I left them in their box. So to actually have one to take out of the box, that's what I'm excited about. And I'm also gonna, I have one on the way to leave in box as well, because I can't, I can't just have one. <laughs> so let me get her out. Okay, you guys, she is out of the box. And I need to get these a little bit closer because I don't like them, but look at her hair. It's so pretty and nice and neat and shiny super shiny <laughs> but yeah look at her her fuzzy boots i love 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 these boots 
probably keep her in them versus well I'll probably put her in these eventually but and then her pants are so cute too her top is kind of cute and then her face it is so so cute anyways I don't know y'all just heard my dogs bark but for her I wanted to put her in her second outfit kind of but I actually have this one that I could put her in I got it on AliExpress so I think that's what we're gonna do because look the shoes match it so it'll be perfect and then like if I put her in this outfit I'll put her with these fuzzy shoes and this way it kind of looks weird like with this outfit maybe with the smaller yellow shirt and those pants but I don't know so Ooh. she's kind of fuzzy <laughs> or linty let's see how it looks because I haven't even tried this outfit out on any of the dolls yet I just ordered it but I think I'm gonna have to do it off camera because her hands are too hard okay you guys so since I was having trouble getting her hand through I thought of this idea with this piece of bag to try and help get them in there since they're kind of pokey and they this material it was starting to kind of like seem like it was gonna make holes right here so I was like mm, let me figure something else out and it worked so let's just get this one through this side and look her hand came right out and then what you do you just pull the bag through if you can it worked better on the other side but it's getting there perfect this because it was difficult and I did not want to get a little hole in this top so I just figured I would show y'all just in case y'all wanted to try it on any of your dolls clothes that you can't get your their hands through so let's see it looks good so far oh my goodness y'all look at her underwear <laughs> that is so interesting they're like the same color pink as her like other clothes they're a different shape than like the other dolls underwear it's so weird is the original one ha like this you guys I don't know I've never seen it without its clothes on or did they just make the reproductions like that and the like pant legs they can be a little tricky sometimes too but they don't have all these little fingers on them they just have the two little nubs at the bottom so look at her she is so cute it's like oh bubble gummy pink oh my goodness you guys I'm so glad I got her this outfit and you guys I love stuffed bears I love bears I love little brown bears they're just so cute so I love the little bear on her top and let's put the shoes And there she goes oh my goodness and all her pink bubble gum <laughs> like glory she is ready for a little camping sleeping time oh my gosh you guys I can't wait to take pictures of her and put her next to like my other favorite dolls that I have because she's 
definitely now one of my top favorites in that outfit yes you guys so i'm gonna keep this just mm, no none of the rest of them have anything like she has this one long sleeve shirt if i wanted to put it back on her i could do this again but i'm not gonna put it back on her for a while probably or i don't know if ever you know or maybe if i ever find another doll that i want to put it on i can so let's go ahead and get into tiana next fiona she's cute and all like i love her face it is so pretty but this second outfit is like my least favorite so that's kind of why i decided to do her last but yeah let's get into tiana she's so cute okay here she is and her color box is also like a super pretty color also <laughs> sorry i said that twice is it also twice or three times now but yeah it's like a really dark vibrant red i really like it so let me go ahead and get her out these pants are kind of weird i don't know i i feel like they should be a little darker not as like in your face but yeah okay so i have tiana out and here she is her earrings her hair it's really cool unique it's like i like the red it's like so stripy i don't know but yeah and her eyeshadow is super pretty too it's like purpley and a cream color I guess and her red lips and then let's see her top is cute and oh my gosh you guys I'm not taking it off because it's one of these that you have to tie and I don't like dealing with those so I guess that's what she is gonna stay in for the rest of her life but the bottoms I could change and anyways here's her shoes which are basically what I had my other Dana wearing already. Just the brand new ones that are shiny. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly the same. A lot of dolls come with those. So her belt is really cool. And her pants are really soft. Like, I kind of like them better without the coat on her. I think it looks cuter, but I wonder how her shoes would look with these boots because these shoes are just so plain. So let's see how these boots look with these pants. But yeah, I think that looks okay. I'll probably leave her like that. Because you guys, y'all know how I feel about big puffy jackets on my dolls. Like, I do love this jacket that Felicia came with, but I probably won't put it on any of my dolls. But I do like it. I do like this one also. It's just so big and bulky and puffy, and I just don't like that. But yeah, she is so cute now. She was cute before, but I'm cuter this way. So I think we're going to put her second outfit on Jade. Cause look at this. This dress is falling apart in my hands and it's like, it's just icky. It's, I don't know. I just really wanted to put it on a doll and this Jade was one of the like only dolls at the time. So she is due for a little update and she has this little blue spot on her face that i tried to get rid of but i need to retry because i i think i i messed it up like i took away a little bit of her blushing so i need to do the acne treatment on it because that worked with one of my other recent dolls i've gotten but i need to take off her like all these little sparkles before I put on a different outfit on her but I like these shoes they are so cute you guys some of my favorite molds for shoes and so let's see 
Does anyone else take off their doll sh brat's shoes like that? Or do y'all just pull them off? And I think like all the new doll shoes, like the colors for their skin are just so bright and different than for the old dolls because uh, probably the old dolls faded a lot too they might have been bright back then when we first got them but like these shoes look how like pink the skin tone is for them versus the regular other dolls but that's okay I got plenty of brat shoes, actually. Ooh, this top is so cute. Yes, look at her. I can basically just put the other Dana shoes on her. And then it's basically the same outfit. <laughs> but I was gonna put these shoes back on that Dana. But now I'm thinking maybe I should just put Felicia's second outfit and shoes on that Dana. Because I don't think I'm gonna put Fiona's second outfit on anyone. And so, yeah. Let's go ahead and get into Fiona. Here she is. Her face is just so cute. I love her little hoopies. And yeah, let's get right into her. Okay, so here she is. And you guys, this is kind of funny to me when I pulled her out. Like all of these just came out like through the cardboard or whatever. So I'm gonna have to clip those, but I'd rather do it with like some cuticle clippers. So I'm gonna probably wait to do that. But here she is. Look at her hair. It is really pretty. I just don't mind that. And her eyes. She has like a really pretty green and like purplish pink eyeshadow. It's pretty interesting. And then her eyes are green also. She is really, really pretty. Like, I don't, I've never had the original one, I don't think. But this one is definitely better because of her face. I do like the original one's, like, colors of her, um, top and shawl and shoes better. But it's okay. So, these are more, like, regular purple and the others were more, like, um, burgundy, I suppose. Yeah, I do love these earrings. She just looks so cute. Like, I love her more out of the box. And I wonder, these boots would probably look cute. I don't really like these that much. I don't know. So I'll probably put her in those boots. And then, funny enough, my flashback fever Fiona came with this shirt. So she's still wearing it. And the shirt is kind of cute. I just think, like, it's the skirt for me. Like, they're not really, you know, up to today's fashion. They're really, like, people don't wear these long skirts anymore that would come, like, down to your ankles almost. People just don't. But maybe they could come back one day. Like, how the other things in flared jeans, maybe they'll come back too. Since, like, everyone wants to wear those mom jeans and whatever. So maybe since everyone was into like Y2K and stuff, but they never brought back like the flare jeans and long skirts like that as, as far as I've seen. But look, you guys, this piece of hair is so hard. It's like a wall. Like the hair on top of it is nice and soft. But this one is just so like so crazy. It's like why she does not need all this in her hair and now her shawl is falling off 
it's a pretty unique item. You kind of have to place it on them a certain way for it to stay. And then it had like the little things through it, holding it like together, the little plastic pieces in the box. But yeah. So let's put these shoes on her. If we can with the jeans. Because they might not let us. Yes, they do. That's a good thing. That's probably why they had so many flare jeans back in the day, because everyone wore all these boots. And then <laughs> look at like the the indention of them. Well, well, at least they allowed for them to go on for the brat dolls pants, basically. Yeah, there she is. And I'll probably keep her like that. So, I think we'll end this by just putting Dana in Felicia's other second outfit. Because she's cute like this, but I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to keep her. And like I said, I'm not going to put anyone in. Um... Fiona's second outfit. Oh my gosh, you guys. This one, am I going to have to untie it to get it on her? Okay, let me figure this out. Okay, you guys. She definitely looks way cuter in Felicia's second outfit. Look at that. That is so cute. And I mean, she would look so cute in it also. But for now, I will be having her in this and maybe I will change her to like that outfit in like a month or so. I definitely would get a third one just to take it out of box and just have another one to have outfit for. Or I was actually thinking about taking the head and putting on the OMG bottle. I mean, OMG doll. I don't know why I said bottle. That was so random. Oh my goodness, y'all. She has a little hair out of place here look at it um hopefully i can like flatten it down or something because i don't like it look at the little messy pieces here it's okay i guess but yeah so thanks so much for watching y'all and like comment subscribe let me know which of these dolls is your favorite the new ones of course and if you have gotten all four of them did you get the boy also i was gonna order him but i guess i forgot so i might end up getting him eventually because i do have the other two boys so yeah and special thanks to our little buddies jade and extra dana <laughs> for volunteering to be models of a few second outfits today so yeah i hope you guys liked my little video and see y'all next time bye